184 pounds, like you said, that's gonna be Sam Wheeler versus Kenny Courts. Wheeler for Kent State, Kenny Courts for Ohio State. Courts in on a low shot quickly. Credo, possible, Credo needs to secure the takedown first though. They say nothing and now he's on the hip. That is too, the hand was on the mat. As soon as Courts touched the hip, or secured the hip, it was a takedown. Good call by the official. He won Kenny Courts here. And some of the fans here don't like it, but it was a good call. <laughs> yeah, it was the right call. Take them, right call. Kenny Courts had two. This is 184, you're looking at two top 20 guys. Sam Wheeler ranked number 17 by the flow rankings, and Kenny Courts ranked number nine by flow. There's oh, nice over collar shrug. Nothing going, he gives it a shot. Overtight shuck is always a nice one. I like that. Yeah, it's effortless by some guys, you know. Quartz goes three point. And now we're just under the one minute down here in the first period. Two to one. Quartz with the lead. Kenny Quartz took Evans down right away on Sunday, and then things did not go his way after that. Nice shot, Kenny Quartz. Right handed head inside, single on Wheeler. Nice jump down, cut the back, scores the takedown. He's gonna go up four to one now. Minute 35 to go here in the first period. His riding time moving up. And Quartz was behind CJ Magrum, Cody Magrum, the Ocarba Rocket last year. I'm an O'Carver Rocket. I know, I, was. I know you're not. I was. Once, once a rocket, always a rocket. Always a rocket. Oh, so, oh, so one all the team start 119 rounds here. Quartz on top, 4 to 1, 23 seconds of ride time for Court. Can he ride? Can he go Central Dolphin, Harrisburg, Pennsylvania? Hard ride here. What's he going to do? We will, we shall see. Ooh, a little early there, and he got away with it. That was nice. Quartz drives him to Ford first, gets him flat pretty fast here off the whistle. His riding time's over 30 seconds now, continues to climb. We're just over a minute to go here in the first period. Courts with a 4-1 lead. Wheeler up to his feet. Oh, yeah. He is working hands. And he's got one isolated. He, oh, he thought about firing the shot off right away. Probably better that he didn't because he was not quite in position to score. Had he taken that shot, there's a decent chance that uh, Courts would have had an ability to, or uh, an opening to circle behind. Opportunity, I think, is the word I was looking for. One way or the other way, nice job. Courts back in on a single leg. Goes Wheeler. head inside. Look at Wheeler. Squares up. Spreads his hips. Wheeler's going to turn around. And Wheeler scores a takedown. Nice job for Wheeler. He's going to tie this thing up at four here with 20 seconds to go in the second period. I don't know what that was, but it was really athletic and pretty, pretty amazing. Quartz was in so deep, I was sure he was about to score. Four, four, not at the four, four at the end. And he ran down about 20, 20 seconds of riding time there. He has a riding time down 20, at 21 seconds in favor of Kenny Quartz, who's going to have choice here going into the third. He chooses underneath, so I got to put this out there. Kenny Quartz dominated that first. Yes, and I mean, it's four to four. Unequivocally, like, should be six to two right now. That tells you why the takedown in the riding is so important. And uh, quickly, quickly, he gets away. So Wheeler's going to need to find himself a takedown in the next minute and 48 seconds. Were you on the uh, Dudley Quartz match? I was not. I was next door doing the other. I don't remember if I was. I think that was quarters at Las Vegas is what you're referring to. That match is on flow. I haven't even had a chance to watch it. Everybody raved about it, how awesome it was. Um, so if you get a chance, go to Flo and search Kenny Quartz versus uh, Dudley, Nebraska. Yeah, Quartz Dudley. Good, great match. Google it. Flo, Google it. Flo, Google it. Flo, Google it. Flo, Google So, minute 13 to go. 5 4, Quartz with the lead. And Wheeler, gonna try to come forward. He's gotta get something going here. He gotta take down off, of course, shot there in the second. 
Quartz does not need to shoot. Quartz can be conservative if he wants. The one that needed to go forward is Wheeler. He needs to go get a takedown here. Dennis goes and gets that low single. And Quartz left legs out of it. Quartz takes a little shot of his own. 5-4 here. Quartz up. 45 seconds left in the second period. Kenny Quartz. Not in the driver's seat by any means. I thought he was, but Wheeler comes back, steals a takedown at the end of the period, and that's why wrestling the entire three minutes is really important, Mark Vader. Yes, sir. You know a thing or two about a thing or two about that, don't you? I know uh, a thing or two about one or two things, but that's it. Okay, well. 20 seconds to go on this bout. One point lead for Kenny Quartz, and you know, is Quartz, I think he's gonna be content to not attack. And, and as soon as I say that, he proves me wrong. Goes one way, the other way, misdirection. Put him almost to his quad. time. Six seconds, is Kenny Quartz gonna get this? He is oh, gonna get it. Quartz a takedown right at the end of the match. Two more points. Makes it 7-4. That's gonna be the... No, shoot. One more period. Oh my God. I'm in, a, I'm in a whole other world here. First period took a little, took a little while. It's another match now. 7-4. Look at the 5-4. Kenny Quartz also he got that takedown and he did a great job of finishing the period. Didn't finish the first period like he should have. Finishes the second period like he should have. Great strategy, great hustle by Kenny Quartz. And, and really important, and important to get that takedown at the end of the first because it's a two-point takedown. There's no time for that guy to get the escape. And now Quartz drops down ankle. Wheeler's trying to kick out. Quartz working back up the body. Quartz and needs to climb. And he does. Wheeler tries to climb up again. 47 seconds left. Or so. Courts away and try to get another takedown. And, and this match just got exciting, Zeb. Eight six. And there's a oh, shot by Wheeler. Shot, nobody's home. Courts takes a knee. Oh, he goes one way, comes back the other. And the second time we've seen him do that, this match is like this. Mars Wheeler scores the takedown. We are tied eight to eight with just under one minute to go. Courts tries to grab me through. Wheeler stays with it. Now you're Wheeler, and there's a 50 seconds to go. You kick him away, or you try to ride him the rest of the entire period, Zeb. I was gonna lose this right here. And once again, Courts. Now it's Courts gonna put his skates on and go backwards. Or is he gonna stand in there and wrestle? Oh, beautiful job, Courts. He's gonna cement this if he can get a takedown. He's gonna burn time. He gets a takedown and ices it. Now Sam Wheeler and Courts. but Kenny Quartz in a very fun match here. Another one tonight that's just been back and forth this couple ways. And in the reverse off the end, it doesn't matter, but it makes it even a little bit more exciting. I love it. And, and 21 points on the board. Wheeler and Quartz put on the show for the fans here at Kent State. Final score, 11-10, Kenny Quartz your winner. Mark 